Tuesday the 22nd of August 2023 First reading Reading from the Book of Judges The angel of the Lord came and sat under the terebinth that offer which belonged to Joseph Abiza. Gideon his son was threshing wheat inside the winepress to keep it hidden from Midian when the angel of the Lord appeared to him and said The Lord is with you, valiant warrior. Gideon answered him Forgive me, my Lord, but if the Lord is with us, then why is it that all this is happening to us now? And where are all the wonders our ancestors tell us of when they say, Did not the Lord bring us out of Egypt? But now the Lord has deserted us. He has abandoned us to Midian. At this the Lord turned to him and said, Go in the strength now upholding you, and you will rescue Israel from the power of Midian. Do I not send you myself? Gideon answered him, Forgive me, my lord, but how can I deliver Israel? My clan, you must know, is the weakest in Manasseh and I am the least important in my family. The lord answered him, I will be with you and you shall crush Midian as though it were a single man. Gideon said to him, If I have found favour in your sight, give me a sign that it is you who speak to me. I beg you, do not go away until I come back. I will bring you my offering and set it down before you. And he answered, I will stay until you return. Gideon went away and prepared a young goat and made eleven cakes with an ephah of flour. He put the meat into a basket and the broth into a pot, then brought it all to him under the terebinth. As he came near, the angel of the Lord said to him, Take the meat and unleavened cakes, put them on this rock and pour the broth over them. Gideon did so. Then the angel of the Lord reached out the tip of the staff in his hand and touched the meat and unleavened cakes. Fire sprang from the rock and consumed the meat and unleavened cakes, and the angel of the Lord vanished before his eyes. Then Gideon knew this was the angel of the Lord, and he said, Alas, my Lord, I have seen the angel of the Lord face to face. The Lord answered him, Peace be with you, have no fear, you will not die. Gideon built an altar there to the Lord and called it the Lord, is peace. Responsorial Psalm The Lord speaks peace to his people. I will hear what the Lord God has to say, a voice that speaks of peace, peace for his people and his friends, and those who turn to him in their hearts. The Lord speaks peace to his people. Mercy and faithfulness have met, justice and peace have embraced, Faithfulness shall spring from the earth, and justice look down from heaven. The Lord speaks peace to his people. The Lord will make us prosper, and our earth shall yield its fruit. Justice shall march before him, and peace shall follow his steps. The Lord speaks peace to his people. Gospel Acclamation Alleluia, Alleluia Teach me your paths, my God. Make me walk in your truth. Alleluia. Gospel. Reading from the book of Matthew. Jesus said to his disciples, I tell you solemnly, it will be hard for a rich man to enter the kingdom of heaven. Yes, I tell you again, it is easier for a camel to pass through the eye of a needle than for a rich man to enter the kingdom of heaven. When the disciples heard this, they were astonished. Who can be saved then? They said, Jesus gazed at them. For men, he told them, this is impossible. For God, everything is possible. Then Peter spoke, what about us? He said to him, we have left everything and followed you. What are we to have then? Jesus said to him, I tell you solemnly, when all is made new and the Son of Man sits on his throne of glory, you will yourself sit on 12 thrones to judge the 12 tribes of Israel. And everyone who has left houses, brothers, sisters, Father, mother, children or land for the sake of my name will be repaid a hundred times over and also inherit eternal life. Many who are first will be last and the last first. Gospel of the Lord.